So we're down at the pier head and I couldn't believe this fact when I heard it, Peter, that we've never had a water taxi service in Liverpool. A city like this with, with no water, until now, yep. things are about to change with, yep. with this little beauty behind us. Yeah, we've been working on this for a good 12 months now, this project, and uh, we, you know, we've got three boats all together with the Neptune. Uh, we sourced the boat uh, about 18 months ago. I've uh, done considerable amounts of work on it to make it feasible for operational in this uh, this area. Okay, so in we're starting in, in, in the pier head now, but this is in conjunction yeah. with, with the Titanic Hotel That's as correct, well. yeah, yeah. So will it be mostly guests from the hotel? Yeah, can, can anyone Gu guests get from the hotel this? Titanic side will bring them into the, you know, Man Island, and they can go onto the Albert Docks, it's right based here. And then obviously guests from anywhere, tourists from anywhere can jump on board the Man Island and we can Brilliant. take them through to the Titanic Hotel. And it's the first ever in Liverpool? It is, yeah. That's yeah. crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, this, this, this neck of the woods anyway. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah. So what can we expect? Because obviously we're not going out onto the Mersey. We're going no. through some of the canals, through the yeah. locks. We're going, through the, the we're going through the linkway. Uh, we're going to basically go from this one island uh, basin here, head through under the, under the uh, tunnels. You've got the uh, library buildings as you come out the other side of the tunnels. Then we go under the Isle of Man berth. Um, that is a tunnel. That's where all the cars go across to the Isle of Man. Okay. And then we'll come out by the Prince's Lock and um, we go into the lock then we'll level up to the canal level or the, the dock level I should say and then um, open up the, the leading gates and we'll head out into uh, Princess Dock mm -hmm. proceeding on into uh, Princess Basin where you see all the old uh, dock gates where the ships used to come in and out so you get a bit of history on this oh, as well it's fantastic it's not, it's amazing history. Boat ride. You get, no you get the, his, the history you get history tour as well because we myself and the other the other skippers will give a, a talk on the, what we're doing and you know about the docks as well it's fascinating so we call you a skipper skipper yeah skipper yeah okay what's it like to drive one of these it's Does it drive the right word uh helm helm, helm. is a correct, uh, correct what's it like to helm one of these it's great it's a fantastic little boat it's been a good work boat for the port of liverpool since 1984 uh, uh, i've been told and uh, it was um it's known as a gig boat previously and it yeah. took the lines off the ships and uh, tied the ships up um, outside on the, uh, on the River Mersey so and the Charming Stages. Some, some history this has probably worked in, you know, around those docks. It has definitely worked around those docks um, where it's going to be operating uh, with okay. passengers. Can we get on and, and Absolutely, do yeah. Will, Absolutely. Peter, look forward to it. Welcome, Jake. Thank you. So we finish our journey back here at the Titanic Hotel on Stanley Dock on this brand new taxi service for Liverpool. And what a journey it was, there are things that I've seen there that I've never seen in all my life for living here in Liverpool and views I've seen in the city uh, which you've got to come and see yourself. We're going to get off now and chat to the Deputy General Manager uh, of the Titanic Hotel here on Stanley Dock. What a great new service you're now offering. That, that was stunning and to do it as the sun was setting as well was, was even more special. Yeah, it is. It's, um, it's another additional service um, for the hotel itself. I mean, we're still relatively new to the city. Um, we've been open a year and a half now, but um, we're not too far out of the city. If you want to take a taxi into, into town, that's not a problem. It's a five pound cost, yeah. but we, we thought we'd try and do something different. Um, we have a wonderful feature, which is the river, the famous River Mersey over there. And um, yeah, we, we got approached by Peter about the idea of a, a ferry taxi. Um, we worked closely with him to see what that looked like and we've, we've had a few test runs ourselves and it's, it's stunning it, just to see the city from another angle. The views I've lived here all my life obviously and the views from, from the boat then, they were views yeah. I've never seen before and yeah. that's why I'd say to, to check it out to anyone watching. Yeah. Um, you do see the city from a different angle don't you? You do but, but also it, 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 we get a lot of guests that come through, some want to relax, some are tourists, some are here for the football. Um, but actually, most people just want to see the different side to Liverpool. It's, it's, it's a unique city. We're a unique hotel. And what we've found is another unique way to see the wonderful city that is yeah. Liverpool. And it's a great service. It, it, you get a bit of history in there. You learn a bit more about what the city offered um, a number of years ago with the, 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 the ferry services. Um, and again, we get a lot of guests um, with a lot of interest in what the city might look like from another angle. Plus, at this time of night, you get an amazing view, and the sunset's just behind us there. And, and the it, Prosecco and is, is pretty good the as well. The Prosecco's pretty say, good. Yeah, 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 a couple um, of glasses helps. Yeah. Yeah. We've got we to gotta briefly talk about this place. You, yeah. you mentioned there it's, it's only 18 months old. It feels like this hotel has been part of Liverpool now forever. Yeah. 
Um, I'm in and out all the time, and I think many people watching will be too. You guys are doing a good job. We've, we've got to pat you on the back. You, you're doing a good job. Uh, yeah, we're we're working hard. Um, and the the way I mean, whilst we're a hotel, we've got to get our guests to the door. Um, we've also made the effort to reach out to, to the local area itself, the local community. We're building partnerships, mm. and we're making friendships. Um, and I think that's really what we found out about Liverpool that it's. It's a big city, um, but there's plenty of people that are invested, particularly in the history of this building. It's the old run warehouse yeah. right opposite the tobacco warehouse. You know, there's a lot of hardworking people that worked here a number of years ago, and we're trying to reciprocate that by working hard, making sure that everything that comes through has a great, unique experience, with that great Liverpool-friendly service, um, with another addition, which is the ferry boat taxi. That you can see Liverpool from another angle, but it's it's just meeting people. It's a great place to meet. You want you want to just come down for a drink? Great. You're by yeah. the water. Have a, have a chat with your friends. Have a coffee. It's free Wi-Fi. All all the things that most hotels will throw in, but we offer just that something different, which is, you know, we work hard. We'll, we'll welcome you to a wonderful building. It's, it was a wonderful building anyway, but now mm. we try to really capture what was put into it that hard work that pioneering industry and we're just trying to embrace that and the city the city seems to be really behind that brilliant finally just just tell me briefly one thing that you love most about this hotel one room or one one thing that you do here because there's so much to see give me one thing that you personally uh, uh, love. I, I think uh, to be honest i'll go back to my guys my team and every month we have a, a team meeting the whole hotel and I, I, sometimes it's easy when you're hard working to forget where you are. I remind them, you know, remember the first day you walked through the doors. And I think that's the point. You walked through the doors, nothing's been covered up. We've tried to keep everything that was there before. The pillars that hold the building together. We've got features, the barrels that remind us of the history that used to be here. It's, it's Titanic. There's a lot of history in that, you know, White Star Lines. And it's about reminding them again and again, just remember when you work first, first walk through those doors, wow. And that's, that's what we drive, drive. Wow. It's what the a wow great factor. Way to end. Simon, thank you. And I look forward to a uh, taxi boat ride back. <laughs> and a couple more Proseccos. Yeah, that would do nicely. <laughs> thank you, mate. Lovely. Thank, thank you very chat. much. No problem.